Yeah, well, there's my uh, 2001 XR 650L. Well, I just put a new carb in it, and uh, it's an FCR carb, uh, 41 millimeter carb. I got that off of eBay there to OEM carb, and uh, I just jetted it in there, dialed it in pretty close there. It's fairly close. Very small adjustments there needed there to get it to be perfect, but it's very very close right now. Uh, like I say, it's a, it's an FCR carb, and uh, I've got a, a an NC VR needle in it on the third clip. Yeah, it works pretty good. I've got a 40 pilot jet in it and a 160 main jet, and the uh, pilot air jet is a hundred. And like I say, it works very well, really good right now. I've got a little bit of a rich uh, condition at uh, very, very low throttle position. Uh, I'm going to try another needle to see if that's going to fix it. But uh, like I say, but it is very, very close. It's quite cool here, so I'm kind of expecting maybe in the summer when it gets warmer that I might need a, to tweak that needle a little bit there, or maybe just a clip of the position will do. Here, let's just start her up. See how she runs. We got a wide band oxygen sensor here that I've temporarily mounted on my Honda bars here for tuning. And uh, she starts pretty quick there. It's uh, like I say, it's tuned pretty good right now. switch on it should flash until the heat the sensor is heated to temperature and it should read the maximum scale of course the engine's not running so it should be reading a very lean mixture there you go so we'll go ahead and start the engine See how it reacts. That's how she runs. And just quickly, I ran the wires along the frame, just following the other harness that was there, and uh, installed the uh, oxygen sensor. Right there. I know it's in the way of the mud and shit on the wheel, but it's only temporary until I get this carb kind of calibrated. Then I'll be taking it off. I've uh, ran the sensor, con the controller wires into the uh, pouch here in the back, so it doesn't. Uh, that was about the only place I could put it, so it'd be out of the way. So all like the computer connections uh, connecting to my laptop, wires are all in that, and. Uh, I found that was the easiest place to put it. It's only temporary as anyway, so it's a good spot. I'll show you the uh, carb. Not much you see on this side. Let me turn that off. Red, uh, the R&D uh, pump 2 cover for the accelerator pump, it has an adjustable leak jet in the back there, so you can reach from the other side. And this is the NOS, the NOS uh, adapter, airbox adapter that I had to use. And pretty much the rest of it is all the same. And uh, I don't know if you can see underneath there, oh well, yeah you can, right there. Right in that little crack right there you can see that adjustable needle. I got an extended one so I can tune it while the carb's in place. Uh, I better look from the other side. Yeah, I can see it pretty good there now. See, I can 
adjust that with my fingers whereas the other one was flush to the carb you couldn't really adjust it properly and way underneath there you can just make out the uh, behind that screw there you can see there that's the leak jet adjustment I've got that set at a quarter turn right now and that's about it any questions feel free to ask in the forum